hello guys welcome to my channel today in this video i will talk about how to implement admob ads in your kiwi application uh, so you can earn money by using kiwi android application so this video will be very interesting just watch full video don't skip and if you are new in my channel just hit the sub subscribe button like share and uh, to get latest update from my channel just hit the subscribe button uh, okay and uh, so let's start uh, open browser and search kibmob uh, so kibmob is python module uh, by uh, you can uh, um, implement admob ads in your kiwi android application or kiwi md also not only kiwi you can uh, use this for kiwi md also uh, um, you can uh, implement admob ads in your kiwi or kiwi md application okay so <coughs> uh, now first of all you have to just create admob account It is very easy to create AdMob account. Uh, just open AdMob and uh, sign in with your Gmail ID and create an um, ad unit or uh, ad app. Okay, and create ad unit. So uh, and. Um, After creating your um, app, I, app, app, app in Admo and uh, Add ID, you will get this type of IDs. Okay, uh, so you you need this type of ID, uh, interstitial banner, and uh, interstitial video or rewarded video. Okay, so and these all are test IDs, so you can test your uh, application with this ID okay so just and uh, uh, I am not going to show you how to create account and how to it is very easy you can search in internet or YouTube there are lots of video about this so it is very easy okay now and uh, and here one just, there are some examples here just read these things now here uh, I have this is my project folder and uh, this is the main.py here I have imported this uh, from kibmob import kibmob and test ids test ids means this uh, these ids okay and uh, okay, let's increase some increase font size <coughs> and uh, just put this ID, your app ID, in Kibmob. Um, okay, and uh, this app ID. Okay, and here uh, I am just uh, creating a new banner by calling this new banner method from this ads. And this is I am passing this app ID, um, uh, banner ID is here this is banner id and uh, top, just setting top position equal to true means banner ads will show the top position of the screen and here i'm just creating this uh, created this uh, i have created this uh, box layout and i just added these two buttons widget and i have just added two methods when button button is released uh, methods will call method method will call and um, here in call method I am just calling this or this method request banner to request new banner ad and uh, this method will show banner ad in our kv application and this call to method for the height banner ad ok this is very easy mm, now uh, to convert this uh, oh, ok convert this file into an apk you have to just create 
first of all you have to need buildozer and what is buildozer how to install in your ubuntu or linux pc just watch i I'll, i already have uploaded that video just watch that video so uh, after that you have to just need buildozer.spec file to create buildozer.spec file you have to just enter buildozer b u i l dozer in it so this error because i already have this file okay now edit this file with, with any text editor now here just add this title of your application and package name and package domain name and source uh, including include all the source extension which you are using with your application okay and i am just uh, um, excluding this to two directories or folders test and bin i am not using these two folders during build process okay you can set the version of your application and requirements this is very important uh, python 3 kv and android pyunos and kib kib mob you have to just include this mail module with uh, these two also okay and uh, orientation i am just setting the orientation in all all one second okay. and uh, <coughs> you can set it uh, full screen for full screen you have to just enter one otherwise no zero means not full screen and um, android permission you have to just enter internet and access network state permission okay and uh, you can set a uh, api version equal to 30 for android 11 <coughs> uh, okay one second here uh, you have to just enter the maximum api api level <coughs> is 30 okay i'm not uh, doing anything because i i don't need and <coughs> here you have to just enter android gradle dependencies equal to this you can get this from uh give more github page just open give more and uh, here okay it is taking some time oh Here, this is KibMob GitHub page. Uh, just open this KibMob GitHub. I will put the link in description below. So, uh, just add this line or update this line in buildozer.spec file. Okay, here and here you have to just enter the Android metadata equal to this. Um, this line and this is your test app id means this id okay so and one thing very important thing before releasing your application in any store um, like play store or other store you have to just change this your real app id add ids okay uh, and uh, here also you have to just change otherwise uh, test add will will be show in your kv application and uh, uh, you won't get any earning from that uh, that uh, application okay so you have to just put real ids so you you, you will get uh, ids from this add mob add units okay so and uh, I'm just putting this all these things because I'm 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 just uh, testing this. I I will just test all these things. Okay. Uh, and uh, you can get all this test study from here. Just open Keep Mob. And uh, this is banner ID. Okay. This is banner ID. Banner ID. Okay. Now. 
uh, okay here after that you have to just um, uh, uh, just uncomment this lockcat filter so we'll uh, so uh, it will it will uh, uh, show all logs from your android device when your application is running or on your android device okay uh, this python filter will will show only python related logs from your device okay uh, and uh, and you can set the android architecture equal to this i am just setting this for 32 bit and for 64 bit just use this okay for 64 bit new new device uh, all new devices are now 64 bit so you have to just put this okay uh, and uh, i am not doing this because i will run it every old device okay android 5 or lollipop okay so that's all just save control s to save all these things and just open terminal here open terminal here and build and to uh, convert this file into an apk just enter this command Build bulldozer android debug deploy run logcat this deploy and logcat command will push the application in your phone and it will show all the logs when your application is running okay and uh, before that you have to just connect usb connect your phone with your with usb cable and uh, just enable your android debug mode in your phone okay and after that you have to just enter okay first time it will take 30 minutes uh, it will download all these things but i have already done once so it will take small time for me okay just and uh, now it is one second so it is almost done now so if you have any question just comment below and uh, my application is running in my phone and uh, you can see here all logs from my device this is mm, the uh, logs from my android device when my application is running so from this log you can debug your uh, the application why application is not running or crashing you can get all these things here uh, okay so just I am just showing you my mirroring my phone in my uh, um, PC by using this uh, um, program. Okay. Now here you can see there are two buttons: so show banner and hide banner, as I have implemented here. Now I am just showing my and to show banner ads will take some time to load okay I don't know why it is not yes yes this is test banner tested and you can hide by clicking this hide moment so you can uh, uh, show banner uh, by by using this method show banner and you can hide this banner okay also so this is so see here it is very easy to do okay now let's implement interstitial add in this in kv application okay just open kv mob and uh, interstitial add. just copy this um, this uh, example and paste here So, uh, this is a very simple application. Uh, just uh, uh, in this code, uh, um, here this keep mob and test add is imported, and here just in build method, uh, they initialized this keep mob with test add is app. 
this is same this id is okay this id you can copy all this or use this and uh, this interstitial id is okay uh, just uh, requested uh, request this new interstitial ad and pass this interstitial ad id okay and uh, request the interstitial ad and this button will show this interstitial ad this is in this case they use this lambda function of python okay and on resume this uh, they also request this interstitial ad you have to just new create this new interstitial ad just request interstitial ad and show interstitial ad so that's all now i'm just rebuilding this application uh, and uh, for one add app um, this is fixed this is fixed this is always same for one add app okay so you can get add app and add ids from this badmob account you have to just create add app and uh, after that you can get this add ids okay and app id okay so now it is just almost done one second 16 minutes okay so you can you can see the all have logs from my application okay my application is started now this time just launch um, mirroring my uh, phone to get okay so to show the application you have to just click this interstitial okay now guys you can see here the interstitial ad it is very showing in my phone and you can close or you can yes you can see here also so that's all mm, so you can thus you can uh, just add add mob ads in your kv application and earn money from that so here you can see the you can read the documentation okay and uh, that's all for today in next video i will talk about the rewarded video ads it is um, some tricky uh, so i'll talk about in next video just stay tuned and uh, like share subscribe my channel support me so um, and um, okay and uh, share my videos okay so that's all for today uh, see you in next video